Half of you guys think that I will die. I'm instantly sad that we don't live here. Okay, you guys, there's been progress in the basement. More framing started to happen, and so I thought I would show you. And it's so crazy that there's like walls up now. So this is gonna be the hallway. The hallway is gonna open up to a door right here for the bathroom. On this side, there'll be a door to this first bedroom right here. If you go down this hallway, you'll get to the other bedroom. That's what they framed so far, and it's so weird because now I can start to tell what it's actually going to look like. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We have some exciting news for you, and that is we are going on a trip. I think we've talked about this on the vlog a little bit, but we planned to go to Australia last year, and it ended up that we couldn't end up going because we moved to Utah, and it was just going to be too much. And so we decided last year, well, we're for sure going to go next year in March. So that time has come, and I'm so freaking excited because the last time we went to Australia was when Ozzy was just under one years old, and now she's going to be turning five in Australia, which is just like mind-blowing because five to me just seems like so old and i just can't believe she's going to be starting actual elementary school this year it's just blowing my mind we decided that we're going to go to australia but the flight from utah is 24 hours of traveling to get to australia and it's only like 10 from hawaii so we decided to kind of book end australia with hawaii which is going to be so much freaking fun because we're going to be staying with our friends and be able to see everyone out there so we're flying to hawaii in two days and we're gonna be there for five days and then we're flying from Hawaii to Australia. We're gonna be in Australia for three whole weeks. I'm so excited I can't even take it. And I think this is for sure our longest trip like out of the country that we've ever done. And ever since going to Australia, we just like knew we wanted to go back and we wanted to stay even longer. We're so grateful that we can do this. We thought we'd share the vlog of packing and getting to Hawaii and kind of what that's all gonna entail and the craziness of traveling with the toddlers. But they're actually really great at traveling and they love traveling and they're so excited to go. Let me stick this to my freaking window, my arm. Ozzy keeps saying, my birthday's gonna be in Australia. I get to turn five in Australia. And she's been talking about it for months since we planned this trip. I just feel like Australia has it all. It's like the weather, the beach, the waves, the people are so freaking nice. And then the food is like next level. Like I don't know how to describe it other than just is like the best food I've had. <laughs> We're going with the Castellanos and the Kents. If you can't get it, I'm, I'm a little excited. So I'm starting to pack right now. I did do like a big thread up order a couple weeks ago so that I would be prepared to have like some fun things to bring to Australia and Hawaii. And big shout out to thread up for sponsoring this video. Thread up, if you didn't know, is an online thrift store basically. So everything is secondhand, but they have thousands of brands, like anything you can think of, like they have the brand on there and it's super fun because you get to just like sift through online like things and it ships right to your door every time i've done a thread up order they become like some of my favorite pieces so it's just really fun so i thought i'd show you some of the things that i ordered right now i ordered a couple of levi pants that i want to turn into shorts so here's the first pair it's like a little bit short on me so i thought i would take these ones and i'm kind of trying out the longer length of shorts so i'm gonna cut them really quick okay these are the second pair of Levi's that I ended up getting. These ones are so cute. But I also want to cut these into shorts. So I'm going to mark these ones up too. Are you wearing my slippers? Yes. Stella, what did you find? Boots. Boots? Are those mommy's boots? No, you. I. They're Ozzy's boots? Yeah. Wow. I'm going to start cutting. Why are you cutting it? Well, because I want to make them into shorts. Well, because you have two jeans. Because I have so many jeans, but I don't have enough shorts. Ugh. Can I help you? Perfect. Two shorts. Okay, Stella, you gotta back up, or else I might cut you. Mm. Mm. It's not on purpose, sis. So you just gotta give me a little space. There's a tiny little cut right there. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> Shorts number one. Do you want to put these on? Really cute pants, Oz. Okay, the shorts turned out cute. That's mine. The shorts are not cute? No, they turned out really cute. Okay, this is a cute length. I think they turned out so cute. What the heck is on your head? <laughs> they have the little one of my pant legs on a skirt. <laughs> on their head. Hello, I'm a chef. I'm a chef. You're a chef? I'm a chef, a chef, a chef, a chef, a chef. Ow! Ow. I can see you. Uh, I can see you, Stella. I can see you. I, I can see you, Stella. Oh, no, you're a monster. Lately, Stella, when she gets upset or frustrated, she goes to close the door. Cause that's like she likes to close the door but she doesn't know how to open our doors because they're like pretty hard to twist <laughs> she'll go out and pretend like she's gonna close the door all the way to like show how she's like upset but then <laughs> doesn't close it all the way because she wants to be able to open it if she wants to come back in you want to get it off yeah anyway it's just really funny because then i just see her face like waiting till she wants to come back in <laughs> i'm like i can see you okay here's another shirt that i got from thread up it's a madewell tank top button up which is so cute i didn't know it was really cute with these cutoffs I love the length that I went with. I got a bunch of tank tops just because we're going to the beach. It's originally from Vanuk. I think it looks so cute. It has like this nice little detail, but it's originally $38 and I got it for $19.99 and I think it's such a cute tank. I got my very first halter top originally from Collusion. Estimated retail for this top is 25 bucks and I got it for $12.99. Okay, I got this Zara dress that actually is brand new with the tag still on it. So cute. Okay, and I also got this denim jacket, like this oversized denim jacket originally from Uniqlo. Okay, I'm so stoked about these pants. They're originally from Lululemon. They have like these pink stripes on the side and I just think that they're so such a cute little cash pant. So yeah, those are some of the things that I got in my thread up haul. I also got a bunch of cute stuff for the girls. Okay, here are some things that I ended up getting for the girls. I found this really cute brand um, called Lily Pulitzer and they had all these dresses and th so the girls can match and they're like different prints but same vibe of a dress and I found the same brand in the pants. This is where I find like really cool brands that I didn't know about before as well and you can find brands that you know and love like I got them tank tops from The Gap and all that fun stuff. It's fun to shop secondhand so then you know that it's good for the planet. Hi. I'm sorry for the jump scare. I'm coming in from the future because I thought it would be fun to share my favorites from ThreadUp. So I went on when I was shopping for my big ThreadUp haul, I favorited a bunch of items on there and you guys can shop all of the stuff that I've favorited. Make sure to go look at my favorites because I favorited a bunch of cute stuff that is still available. What? Did you just literally crank your back out? This sucks. I gotta go to the sun. I gotta go to the sauna. Why is it always the day before a flight? You like convince yourself to throw your back know. out. I need to fix this now. Oh it's my gonna gosh. take two days to fix. Every single time before a flight, two days before, he's like, I threw my back out. And I'm like, you're literally convincing yourself no, that you're one, throwing your back out. This one makes sense why it hurts. I've been doing a lot of manual labor. Like a thousand percent more than I typically do. The other one, I literally convinced myself. I was like, oh man, I'm thinking about Man, wearing that backpack carrying kids, that's gonna hurt my back. And then I had the thought, and then all of a sudden I was like, uh-uh. Yeah, that was the dumbest oh. shiz I've ever seen. And then seen it was the life. worst back pain I've ever had. Yeah. And I and I and I did it up here. Yeah, that's scary. Scary and cool though. Ozzy folded <laughs> these clothes all by herself. She brought them over and she was like, look what I did. I folded them. And they're literally perfectly folded. How did you do that? I just practiced with daddy. That's really, really cool. Are you gonna go fold some more stuff? Okay, I'm gonna show you where to pull. Daddy okay. has to go to the doctor. Tanner! Can I trust you? No, I feel like you should do it. I can't feel, okay, where, there's the hole that hurts, that hurts. It could be angled like this, it could be angled like this. I see what you're saying, hello. He's taking out his earring and he's getting on his, he got his little hoopies. Okay, so. I put something on my story, I said, hey, it's been just over two weeks. Do I do this or not? Half of you guys think that I will die. I am gonna shower first though, so that I can clean it here so it's not like oily. I need trust and confidence. Uh, I'm Take it. confident about this routine. Okay, ready? Yes. Okay. It's in? It's in. 
Cool! Thank you! Mm. It's like bent a little weird. That's okay. Is it, it looks more piratey. You did not. Yes. You did not just do that. Yes. You're packing yourself for Australia? You are so big. What the heck? Are you turning five soon? Yeah, in Australia. So basically, I created a monster because a couple weeks ago, what did you say? You were like, I'm never I comfortable was, in my, was, like, I, I don't said, have yeah, like, pajamas. I don't, I don't like, know what to wear to bed anymore, man. Like, everything I wear bugs me to bed. I was like, oh, you should try my pajama bottoms because I just wanted him to see how comfortable pajamas could be. I didn't want what happened next to happen, which is that he wears my pajama pants every single night now, like every single pair that I own. And now I don't have like pajama pants on the ready for me. It's like I turn around, next thing I know, he's in my next favorite pair of pajama pants. And I'm just like, wait, I created a monster. I don't know about this. So he comes out in these. <laughs> They're like literally so comfortable. I know. So get your own. No. Literally, I, you, have you wear. Pairs. I want all of my pairs available for me every night. Dude, if you buy me some that are exactly like the women's ones, I will definitely eat, uh, wear them. You will eat them? I'll definitely eat them. It what? It makes me just like actually uh, happier. I don't know if you understand. I understand because I literally I wear them. I bought them. If you understood, there would be zero complaints. We got the girls. Ah! Whoa. Yeah. Monsters. Oh, monster girls. We are currently on our way to the airport. We're going. It's today. I'm so excited. So. So. Feeling good. Hey. Like we stepped off the plane, he's like, I missed that smell. We are here. We made it. Every single time we land in Hawaii, we make a stop to McDonald's, and it is just a necessity because it's like we're the welcome mat. It's a welcome mat. It makes us feel at home. I'm instantly sad that we're not that we don't live here. This is the view that I'm seeing as I'm eating my burger, and <laughs> nothing. Could be better than this. Nothing feels better than this. Nothing feels better than this. I've got to also say that Tanner rented a, a minivan, and this is like the first time that he's done this. And it's the best freaking thing ever. When I saw that he rented a minivan, I was like, yes! So convenient, so nice. We're gonna end this vlog with this. <laughs> We're gonna end this vlog with this. <laughs> It, it sounded like I was about to say like some really deep like <laughs> good something. Okay, wait. Sorry, that's just too pretty. And that's also the prettiest McDonald's. We'll probably start another vlog like for the week of Hawaii for the next five days. But we want to get this one out. We'll be posting frequently because of this trip stuff. We'll see you in the next vlog. Yeah, love you guys. Bye bye, love you. Don't forget to shop my favorites on ThreadUp and use code LOWBEASTIN to get 35% off plus free shipping on your first order.